Buck. Do you remember me? Your mom's name was Sarah. You used to wear newspapers in your shoes. You're a wanted man. I don't do that anymore. Well, the people who think you did are coming right now. And they're not planning on taking you alive. Captain, while a great many people see you as a hero, there are some who'd prefer the word vigilante. You've operated with unlimited power and no supervision. That's something the world can no longer tolerate. I know how much Bucky means to you. Stay out of this one, please. You only make this worse. You saying you'll arrest me? There will be consequences. Captain, you seem a little defensive. Well, it's been a long day. If we can't accept limitations, we're no better than bad guys. That's not the way I see it. Sometimes I want to punch you in your perfect teeth. I just want to make sure we consider all our options. Because people that shoot at you usually wind up shooting at me too. You know what's about to happen. Do you really want to punch your way out of this? What do we do? We fight. Sorry, Tommy. You know I wouldn't do this if I had any other choice. But he's my friend. So was I. You're killing me. I can't believe you released this trailer the night before Thanksgiving travel. But you did! And it was so good that I had to get out of bed to review it. Uh, I will give this my full attention tomorrow with a shot-by-shot -shot analysis. But uh, first of all, I think the Russo brothers being back, you automatically notice the difference. And I think they're just what Marvel need to combat what DC is bringing in 2016. Uh, and then also, what by far and away makes the trailer is the fight at the end where it's two versus one, two on one, with Bucky and Cap taking on Iron Man. That was amazing. Everything else in the trailer was nice, but compared to that, uh, you know, it just couldn't compare. And that was just, it was exactly what I wanted. And I believe that's new to this from what they've been showing. I think they took some stuff out. Obviously, we didn't see the Hawkeye uh, Black Widow uh, exchange that, you know, really caught everybody's attention when they were screening this everywhere but for the general public. But that ending fight was just like, oh, it was everything I wanted. And it was Civil War in a nutshell. And I'm very curious to see how this goes down because it's nothing like the comic. It's so far from the comic, it's ridiculous. However, I think that all of the spoilers and all of the rumors about how this movie has been taking shape that dropped after Age of Ultron are probably right because uh, so far they seem to be correct and everything seems to be lining up. So Captain America Civil War, nothing like the comic, but I think it looks like it can compete with what DC is bringing to the table in 2016. Uh, and the Russo brothers are right for Marvel to bet on, to double down, triple down on them. They're doing Avengers uh, Infinity War. Uh, and I think that ending was just, oh, it was phenomenal. So sleep tight. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow and we will uh, go over this in detail. All right. Good night. Bye.